Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another one. Uh, went pigeon hunting this morning and it was gonna be, well, it was the first time really that I have ever been the shot caller and I did not do a good job. So, live and learn. Uh, I will get better, I'm sure, but didn't work out the way I want. So this video is gonna be sprinkled with pigeon hunts and I decided to have all my stuff with me. I'm just gonna get, I'm just, ugh, English. I'm just gonna go ahead Throw an A-frame right here, and we're just gonna shoot starlings here in the shade for a bit. At least that's a plan anyway. So, yeah, let me get everything set up, and uh, we'll do some more shooting. Okay, well, I got everything set up. Put a handful of uh, the dive bomb pigeon silos and a flock of flicker in there. Did the same thing over here. You know, something to keep their attention off of me. And uh, put up half of an A-frame. You know, I'm actually got some cover this time. Hopefully uh, we get a few starlings in and, you know, hopefully the, the pigeon footage isn't as bad as I am afraid it is. So, let's get into it. There we go. I like that. Other than he landed in the water and I can't go pick him up, I'm not getting in that. That there's a poo pond. Nope. Uh, oh my goodness. Um, who, let's see, we've got to pick out a starling. There's a lot of blackbirds in the air. So, uh, I definitely stirred things up. Hope we get a few more. Oh, come on, go all the way down. He made it in that tree. Keep an eye on him, I think he'll fall down here in a second. Not there, he must have fallen. Okay, well, two for two. Three for three. There we go. I'm having fun. It is awesome. Uh, yeah. Might, might have to make a pile. Well, I can't make a pile if I can't pick them up. I got that one over there that I need to go pick up. And then I put two into the water. So, yeah. I'm having a good time. Sorry, I didn't follow through. Uh, I forgot to reload. Should have followed them all the way down. Four for four. Hey guys, what's up? It's a beautiful morning, and I'm not out after the honkers like I want to be. I'm probably uh, said that a lot recently, but you know, guys got after it up in North Dakota. Looks like there's some groups that uh, got into some birds. A little jealous. But today we're gonna go after pigeons because that's what I have available in my area. So today's pigeon hunt. Uh, it's gonna be kind of a traffic hunt. The birds are actually hitting a field across from where we are. They're flying directly over us, but the field that they're on, uh, the guy doesn't want anyone hunting. So, we're gonna, we're gonna get them in the best spot we know how. Uh, Skyler had hunted this spot last week? Two weeks ago. It was last week. And he had got a few. Um, so today we got four man. We're gonna be out hunting an A-frame, over 10 dozen dive bombs, a couple spinners. I'm excited. If it's anything like, like predicted, we should have a good time. We're gonna have a good time regardless. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and drive, we're gonna get set up. I'll pick you guys up then. Can I show you what's going on? And uh, hopefully we have a good one. Okay, so it's a plowed field. Nothing really, really fancy to get them in here, but we've got a handful of spinners out. Just set a big blob, but 10 dozen of them. It's a big spread for pigeons. It's going to be awesome. At least I think so. There's already been one kind of cruising around. There were some honkers that kind of came through. Oh, season's so close. I can taste it. I can just taste it. But you know, 
I gotta wait till wait till September, get into the, the dove, and then we have teal. Mm. Yeah. Anyway, uh through the A-frame up here, my dive bomb one's coming. I ordered it yesterday. But I went through a little green netting cover over the front of it just to sort of blend in a little bit better. I love this time of year. Oh, here comes the first group. Hopefully they uh don't just go flying straight to the other field like that. Cool. If these, oh, okay, cool. Come on, lock up and come down. Or don't. Cool story. Well, that didn't go as planned. Come on, no, don't coast over that way. Turn this, okay, there's two coming back. Oh, there's a red one. <laughs> you birds are jerks. They'll, they'll swing back, they'll swing back. Well, uh, real quick, let's tell you kind of what gear I got going on here. I am using my Super Black Eagle 2. Got, what is it, the Carlson? Yep, Carlson cremated, long range in there. Got the shot cam, obviously. Um, <laughs> that's kind of fun. Little, little new add-on this year for it. But, you know, my duck hunt gun. Uh, man, this gun and I, we got, we have a thing. We, we typically get along pretty well. But, I gotta tell you, these dive bomb uh, shell bags, I love them. I wish they'd be back in stock. They're supposed to be back in stock here in September. One of my new favorite dry line accessories, because uh, a waterproof uh, shell bag is pretty handy, especially when you know you get out in the field, boxes start falling apart. Having be it, being able to just dump them all in a bag and they just close it whenever I want, open it, and keep them waterproof. Love it. And of course the blind bag. My wife calls it my purse because it pretty much goes with me everywhere, but that's not the point. Anyway, let's get a few more birds. All right, here comes some more. Oh, I missed! I mean, I got that one. Tried to double. Hey, one for two, which makes me, is that five for six? I've done way, way worse. Way, way worse. Anyway, uh, all I can do is try again. All right, there's some birds moving around since I shot, but uh, they're kind of high, but there's a few that are coming in a little bit lower. Well, birds keep going over towards this side, so I'm gonna go kick them off of here. Maybe I can get a shot or two, but you know, I also move some stuff around. A lot of blackbirds or cowbirds in this mix. There's a few starlings. A bunch of starlings, actually. About 50 50 mix. I need you guys to fly this way so I can shoot at you. Boom! Should have done that right there. Powdered that one pretty good. Anybody else? All right, gotta get my shell. Bounce this guy off the bag. All right. Actually, let's get a, get a look at him here in the sun. There we go. You gonna come over me? Oh, I missed. Not sure which fundamental I screwed up there, but uh, shouldn't have missed that one. Well, I came back to the blind because I thought, you know, why not be there? I kicked them off over here and they came right back. So we're gonna go hang out by the bags for a little bit, see if we can uh, traffic some there. Might as well go where the birds are. I just wanted to be in the shade. That's really all I was looking for. We need to pick up the blind and go that way now. Yeah. Turtling, turtling around. Just put wheels on this thing and shuttle it back and forth. That is kind of the floating that they did uh, when we were watching them, so they should come back in. I like that. 
There's also a group on the right that's messing around. Hopefully they don't follow them. They're gonna follow them. Pull them over, pull them over. Gave us one look, got drug off by the live birds. That one is. Yeah. This one here. Oh, see the other one. Here comes. Oh. <laughs> come on. That dude. is taunting right there. They're, they're gonna come back around. Ready? Yep. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm always wrong. Yeah. <laughs> uh. you, you, Tristan. Get him. Kill him. I can't see because oh, of the sun. Loaded. That sun is uh, still as bright as it was yesterday. I'm trying to like peek through, <laughs> peek through the grass so I don't get blocked. <laughs> I'm like, I'm blocking the sun. <laughs> Come back. Why? I'm hoping they're gonna cover the top. Right over the top. All right. right over the top of Shoot them. I saw. Yeah. <laughs> I saw it once. Stupid. Woohoo! Hey, here. Hey, we gotta reload. Here, here, here. Come on. Know what? Shells don't go very well in the gun backwards. Alright. Almost need to just move over a hundred yards. <laughs> and that's still so high. Ready? Yeah. Yep, that's about what I was afraid would happen. Come back over. Maybe this guy will come in and die. Kill him. There you go. Boom. Nailed it. Double that one did. So. Try him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey! We got him. Nice shot. That was a pretty one, too. I almost lost my snack stick on the ground. <laughs> Dude, I was shooting with it in my hand. I had to prioritize. Sorry. I kept eating. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, it is a pretty one. This tiny boy. Just a little guy? No. Yeah. Well, cool. He he ate it hard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't go that way. Why did they all turn that way? I'm low and okay, Oh, he's even coming in low. Come on, center up, bud. There we go. Ready? Mm -hmm. Kill him. Oh, that is a smoke bird. Poor guy. Hey, he actually did it good. He's like 700 feet. 700 pellets. All right, don't Snack sticks work every time. Pop one in, birds will show up. Good boy, here. here. Swing around the outside of the spread. That's nice of him. Look, I'm not jogging through that. Kill him. Yeah. <laughs> Got Way to get the extra shot <laughs> oh, that was, that I was, got him! That was skeet shooting there. There's a few more coming down the line. Mm. I was hoping for a double because I knew there were a couple behind him. But I guess we'll have to take the single. Sorry about the weird shot cam movement. I was searching for my second target. So, hey, we got another one. Yep, oh, here he is. Here we go. Hi, ladies. How's it going? Good to see ya. Shoot! Picked up the second on the double and missed the first. I'll get one. I will get one. Uh, let's go see if I can find this bird. Walked right past him. There you go. There's another one.
There we go. Reached out and touched that one. Let me go pick him up. That one made the mistake. All right, well, gotta walk all 10 foot for this guy. I hate when they fall in this tall grass. They are really hard to see. I did find my other one though. Oh, that's a blackbird. God, I know what you're shooting at. For you guys that are like, oh, you can shoot blackbirds. No, you can't. Okay, well you can, you may not. Um, they fall under the Migratory Songbird Treaty Act or something like that. Um, I've been told by a lot of people, oh, you can shoot them in Oklahoma. Oh, we can shoot them here. It's a federal protected bird. I'm pretty sure, I mean, no one knows all the rules. I might be completely wrong, but uh, I'm fairly confident in saying that no, blackbirds are protected. Well, I'm about done stomping through all this. Chalk another one up for a loss. Grab mine there, grab my empties. Get back uh, and wait for a few more to show up. Oh, I shot underneath him, didn't I? Ah! Where are you guys going? Back to the power line. Cool. Love that story. It's the way it's been for about the last half hour. Well guys, it is pretty much noon, it's 11.30. Uh, the birds, they have started flying very, very high. Um, yeah, not much shooting to be had, so I'm gonna go ahead, pack it up, call it a win. I hope this video went together okay. I know there's probably a bunch of jumping back and forth and I'm probably gonna wish I had done a lot better job, but it is what it is, I'm doing my best and uh, hopefully next one will be a whole lot better. But anyway, dove season's almost here. I'm super pumped for that, I hope you guys are too. Hopefully we can get on another pigeon hunt or two. Hopefully they'll be better than this one. I need to really, really improve uh, my shot calling. I guess that's part of learning is, you know, figuring it out as you go. But uh, yeah, I'll do better. Anyway, hopefully you guys liked it. If you guys did, big thumbs up would be appreciated. It really does help out the video a lot. Um, takes you guys about half a second to do. Uh, but I understand if you guys don't, it is what it is. Uh, subscribe if you like the content. There should be a lot of hunting content coming up. I'm gonna do my best to crank it out this uh, this fall and winter. Hopefully get into some trapping. That doesn't start till November, so that's a ways off. But anyway, if you guys like it, subscribe, awesome. Uh, whether you guys do those things or not though, hopefully we'll see you on the next one. I know I already closed out the video, but I'm gonna drop this in a little bit earlier. So here's some of the birds that I picked up got some that are fully feathered um, with the black bill still so they're still pretty young but look at these guys got some juvies here with the adult feathers still coming in I think that's pretty cool anyway I also while I was picking up uh, had a couple birds come over so I saw the shotgun handy so I grabbed it so here's a little bit of shotgun footage uh, as a bonus but anyway see you later <laughs>